What's up, everybody? This is Carolina Mike, your host of SharePoint in 60 Seconds, where sometimes you can get all the info you need in the first 60 seconds, and then you can stick around to see the details. Today, we're going to show you how to add a web part to a modern SharePoint site page. Stay tuned. I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra, careful with my hands because I got to use them forward. Yeah, I'm a big old nerd. I like maple syrup. All my pancakes, I don't care what you heard. All right, here we go. Let's say you got your page and we're showing a couple of web parts. Web parts. These are list web parts, but let's say you want to add some text just above Team Carolina. What you're going to do is you're going to pop into Edit. And you're going to find a place to insert. See how the little plus sign there? So within this block, we can add another web part by hitting the plus symbol. And then we'll just add a text web part. And there you go. That's it. That was way less than 60 seconds. But if you want to get into a little bit more detail, stick around and we can talk about how to mock up this page. All right, so we've got our, our web part in here. Uh, we'll go ahead and save. Go ahead and save as draft. And that will keep it so that your end users won't see it until you republish it. Keep that in mind. Let's say we want to rearrange how things are laid out. Well, we'll go back into edit mode. And then we are dealing with just a single column here. But if we want, we could switch this. We'll edit this particular section. See, this whole thing is a section. And this plus sign right here lets us add a new section between this section and this default comments area down at the bottom. We should also, let's see, we have a plus sign up here. We could add a section between the header and this first section as well. So let's go ahead and add something there and we're going to turn it into a vertical section. Ooh, look at that, fun stuff. So we got, the, we got this deal with a vertical section and then we scroll down, oh, Reminds me, the vertical section goes the full length. So there you go. Once we save as draft, actually that's pretty silly because we don't have anything over here. So let's go ahead and edit and let's add some things. You know, one thing that's pretty neat that you can add over here is a Twitter feed. Let's see what we can get going here with, uh, with Twitter. Let's see. Well, let's try that. Oh, look at there. Pretty slick. Be nice if they had Instagram. That'd be super awesome. We'll republish that. Now everybody can see it. And so now you've learned how to add a web part. You've also learned how to add a vertical section. You've also learned how to add Twitter to that vertical section so you can see what's happening. With that, I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up. Thank you so much for tuning in. Please like and subscribe. We're trying to get 1,000 subscribers by the end of the year. So thank you for anything you can do to help towards that. Remember, SharePoint rocks, and so do you. Take it easy. I'm a SharePoint expert, play with data extra. Careful with my hands, cause I gotta use them.